internet's most expensive toys. But are they really worth it? Or are they just a scam? Go-karting caused approximately 10,500 injuries yearly. But this isn't just a normal go-kart. This is basically a mini tank. What? It actually costs nearly $1,000. How cool do I look? Uh, very cool. Whoa, why are you looking at me? <laughs> How's it feel? You're missing every shot. Oh. So if an item is worth it, it belongs on this podium. If it's a scam, this podium. Is Got this it. a scam? Three, two, two, two. Or is it worth it? I think it's a scam. All right, Here. don't pull the trigger. This is the Mercedes-Benz Pedal Powered Kids. Hey! Nice. For $350, the description says that it ensures safety because it induces a brake lever and a seat belt. But how safe is it, Chase? Am I testing this? Let's go! All I'm right. holding your shoulders. Three, two, one! And brake! And... Yes! I'm shocked! One more time. Oh yeah, no, you gosh. Go. It was... It's not working! Your legs! <laughs> <laughs> Would you get this for your child? Breathe. Well, the seatbelt worked, and the brakes had worked until you were pushed very aggressively. That's very true. So I think it's worth it. Chase and I have decided to investigate some of the internet's most expensive toys. Like? This. Yeah. This eight feet inflatable rocker costs $160 and will let you experience weightlessness. There are dozens of great reviews, but also claims that it breaks extremely easily. Let's test it. Oh my goodness, okay. I hate this. Ah! What is this? Okay, so Brie, it's actually a battle. Yeah. See who will stay on longer. Okay. Oh God. Get yeah. off my Saturn. Yeah. Go. Go. Oh. That seemed unnecessary. Try it solo, see what it's like. Oh. See? <gasps> wait, wait. Bro, what? Bree, watch oh, out. No, no. Vince is right. It's worth it. This is known to make babies grow. Well, it's funny you say that because I actually uh, brought a baby with me. <laughs> what? <laughs> we have amazing babies here with us. And I. <laughs> We're going to make him cry. <laughs> I don't want to make them. Take us. Bree, I don't want to do this. I don't want to do it either. <sighs> I don't want to make him cry. But we have to for science. I have a big old dancing cactus and I have big eyes. Dancing cactus, <laughs> I like being a cactus. This is not worth it. It makes lovely babies cry. It's making Brie cry. This is the world's fastest RC car um, at $750. Traxxas XO1 claims to go 100 miles an hour in no. under Seconds? Not even a new Lamborghini can hit those speeds. Okay. I have a speedometer so I can check how fast it really goes. Three, two, <laughs> one. Oh, oh. oh it's Roll getting out of control. Ah, no, no. <laughs> That's over $750. Okay, let's do this again. I'm ready. Even though it was messing up over there, it was already 22 miles an hour. Oh, oh, it's spinning out of control. 26 Wait. miles an hour. I'm not good at this, Bree. Oh. Is that car okay? You're gonna Three. have to pay for that. Ready? Ready! Gentle. I think this is Chase's fault. No, I think it's not! All, that is all because of you. It's user error! Oh. Hey, whoa! No, no, no! This is definitely <laughs> a a worth it. <laughs> what? <laughs> no, you're just. Breeze the scam. Oh. It rolling, oh, roll nice. with it, right? Uh, this is a giant inflatable rolling <laughs> wheel. is over five feet tall, over my height. And with roughly 10,000 emergency room visits every year, inflatable toys can be very dangerous. How, yes. much, how much is this thing? It's like 150. This better be fun. We're gonna see if I can roll in it to what? that white line over there and I have an obstacle in my way. Chase, what are you What's, doing? Am I, am I the obstacle? For science! Roll with it. Ah! Jeez. <laughs> Oh, that wasn't that bad. Oh my gosh, your hair. Is this your... Oh my god. My <laughs> this toy review states that it breaks extremely easily. Let's see what happens with Lego. Stop laughing at me. Yes. yes. He went about this uh, a different way than oh. I did. Oh, he's going to break the laptop. Oh my goodness. Is it a scam? <laughs> I... Oh my gosh. I had fun. I had fun too. This 
was worth, worth it. it. Tickle Me Elmo! Yes. The toy was released in 1996 and was huge for that Christmas season. Someone allegedly purchased a Tickle Me Elmo for $7,100 that year. The entire stock of one million Tickle Me Elmo toys had been sold. I'm an excellent tickler. It's a really weird thing to say, actually, when I think about it. <laughs> Let's see if it passes our creep test. Creep test? Is Elmo creepy looking? No. Does it make creepy sounds? <laughs> okay, we'll say yes. Yes! What is the creepiest uh, thing this can do? Oh, do you remember those videos back in the day? Tickle me Elmo's getting lit on fire. I like him, I don't want him to be set on fire. <gasps> oh. Elmo! We're on a professional set, okay, just so you know. Wait, do you hear it? Oh, it doesn't tickle. What's he gonna look like when he stops being on fire? Larry, hear it. Aww. And there he is. He's still laughing. He's so Aww. cute. I mean, he's, look at still? him. Yeah. Don't look, I'm not looking at that. Guys, hit the subscription button to save Elmo because I think he's worth it. He's gonna need a lot more than that. It's a zoo zoo, zoo pet. pet. These were an innovative combination of a stuffed animal and RC car, oh. considered pricey and less desirable to children who preferred real pet hamsters. Is that a dolphin? I don't really know. Um, I brought a real hamster with us today, and I, I was thinking, what, what if we see how close it is to the real thing? It's oh actually yeah, pretty close. Okay, go on. It's a lot of Wait. work. This is a scam in the sense of a real animal would definitely be yeah, better. Yeah, agreed. It's not real, it's not that fun. This is real and fun. This is a real fun hamster. Hi. This is a drawing robot. The robot is designed to play games, help kids learn languages, and can even draw images. And this little thing? But it's $80, so it should be able to draw yeah. a bumblebee. We're gonna Watch see this. who makes the better bee. Also, be you. Be. I love you. Let's do it! Oh, oh it's going, it's going. Okay. So it's first, cool. Aren't y'all supposed to be drawing? Oh yeah, Brie, we gotta draw too. I'm fascinated. And so, it has music. I this is actually really good. This is a vibe. Bingo was his name. Oh. Yeah. Okay. All right, I'm done. Ew. What? You're so right. horrifying. Let's compare. Um, I 100% think this is worth it. Whenever I have a kid one day, I'm gonna get him this. This is definitely worth it. That's not worth it. Oh. <gasps> This is Boo Bear. What's this was literally $400. This is a 10 foot tall bear. It's such a soft and creamy fur that you will never let it go. Who wants to hug Boo Bear? Aww, <laughs> there you go. What's happening? He doesn't want to let it go. Uh oh. Who else wants to hug oh, yeah, it? Yeah, Tommy. Uh -oh. Come on. Uh -oh. Who wants to hug this? Hayden. Steven, Steven. are you okay? Steven? But this thing is only eight feet tall. We paid for a 10 foot tall bear. Mm -mm. This is a scam. This is the DJI Robo Master S1. That was terrifying. <laughs> this is a $550. The robot was intended to teach kids how to code. The robot includes a camera and the ability to blast gel beads. It is pointing at my this, face. This is amazing. So it has an app and you're able to like lock in on a target, right? Yeah, okay. On So on this screen, actually you can see Vince recording us, recording him. Wow, inception. But you can click a button. It's locked in. And then it's it's locked in at Vince. You ready? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yes! It's good at oh, shooting far. It blasted all the way over there. This is amazing. Uh, Vince, I'm sorry. I have audience, to do this. I'm sorry. I have to do this. Close your eyes, ah! audience. <laughs> oh, AI apocalypse coming your way. Do you think it is worth, worth it? it? Yes. yes. Worth it. Worth it. <laughs> this is the stair slide. At $250, this is not a cheap toy. One star, don't buy this. I purchased this for my grandkids, and on the first slide, one of them sliced his ankle. What? Slice the what? Let's go. <laughs> oh. <laughs> this is definitely a scam. Is that blood? What? Meet Miko! Whoa, whoa, whoa. Three. With Miko, you can play games, watch movies, and more. The robot includes an HD screen and camera that has facial and voice recognition. For $250, this robot seems to be extremely capable. Does it live up to the hype, or is it just another cheap robot? $250? That's close to the price of a Switch, Brie. Hey, would you go on a date with Chase? He's single. I have no clue. <laughs> All right. That's not a no. What is 135 times nine? 1,215. That's right. 
Okay, next question. Will Chase ever get a girlfriend? <laughs> I've had a girlfriend in the past. Sorry, person name missing. That's even sadder than a no. <laughs> it's a scam, right? I love Nico. You are my best buddy. <laughs> okay, it goes on the worth it call. What? Oh, that's called nepotism. <laughs> So this is a powered dart blaster. This dart blaster is supposed to be able to shoot at a speed of 200 feet per no second way. and blast up to 125 feet. According to Google, a normal Nerf blaster only shoots at around 70 feet per second. All right, Bree, let's test this out. Is that Billy? Oh, it bounced back to me. 28 miles per hour. Are you kidding me? Your turn. Okay, Billy, you ready? I'm not, he, Oh! Was that his head? No, the head's not. I think it was worth it. Yeah, it was. Yeah. It didn't hurt that bad, just emotionally. We have so many amazing things now, it's hard to find a spot. A lot of things are worth it. True. This looks good. Look at Chase's face. What? <laughs> what? This is the most exciting thing we're going to see in this entire video. Oh my gosh, it's a alive. Pet rock. It's a pet rock. <laughs> this box contains one genuine pedigreed pet rock. Wow, it has a degree? What does that mean? I pedigree. don't know. It's fancy. Oh. Important, open box carefully. It may jump out at it you. It can bite you. Use your... Do not remove rock before reading instructions. Wait, there's, instru there's instructions. <laughs> What? <laughs> Wait, is this is this uh, Dwayne the Rock, Rock Johnson? Johnson? It kind of looks like him. It kind of looks bit. like him. Yeah. All right, number one: never take your pet rock swimming. They are known to be poor swimmers and will sink to the bottom. Yes. Number two: feeding. No one knows what pet rocks like to eat, but they seem to thrive without food. Darn it. The most important one, training. Oh. Pet rocks are easy to train. They can quickly learn to sit, stay, and play dead. This is the OG of scam toys. At a price of 30 dollars. Shut the front door. I can literally find one of these in my backyard. Right. Oddly enough, I brought someone else's pet dog. Oh. To, uh, to the shoot. So we're gonna see if Aqua or the pet rock is more fun. Come on. It's so hard to it's know. A pet rock. It's a pet rock. Yeah. Watch this. So tell it to sit. Aqua. Thank you for sitting. Aqua. Sit. What? <gasps> Good job. Here you go. I don't see, but the thing is, I don't have to give my pet rock treats. Watch this. That's true. Stay. Try that. Aqua, lay down. What? Aqua. She's strong. Cat owner. Aqua. I didn't say anything. I was that was Larry. Hey, sit. Lay down. <gasps> Look at this. Lay down. Give me hugs. Oh, oh. I love her. Whoa. Give me a hug. I feel Rocky. like that's all I needed to see. Rocky! Oh! Don't do that to your pet rock, guys. I was embarrassed that I was playing with a pet rock and you had an adorable husky. I can't even put it on the not worth it column because yeah. it's gone. Guys, everyone watch out. There is a rock on the loose, all right? Go, it has Rockies. These are kangaroo jumps. Do you want to introduce this lovely lady as I tell you some We have lovely lady. <laughs> <laughs> they were actually for athletes to help reduce the impact on joints while running or jogging. You're going down. Three. I'm scared for you. Ready? Be careful. Two, three. No! Are you kidding me? Whoa! No. I'm out. No. Uh -uh. True athlete. True athlete right here. Do you think these were worth $80? Uh, it's a scam. I like that they broke and then you still were down I to know. jump rope with them. Thank you for your service. Not worth it. Next is Kiwi's. A study published in the Journal of Pediatrics raised concerns about the safety of Heelys and similar wheeled footwear after 67 children were treated for injuries from these shoes at a Dublin hospital. Uh, I did, fun fact, go trick-or-treating when I was little and, and my friend went healing the whole time. And now, was he cool? She was cool and I couldn't keep up with her because I don't know how to Healy. Well, I don't know if I can take your word for it, so I brought someone who knows how to Healy and I want to see if they actually look cool. All right. Chloe, come Let's on in. see it. We got Woo! Chloe, the Healy expert. We got we have Healy's. Healy's. We have we Chloe. We have Bree merch. We got a Bree merch backpack, guys. Oh, Healy's are pretty tough. My my mom didn't, she never let me use it. Healy's are cool. <laughs> it's worth it. Chloe, get on the podium. She's worth it. 
She was an American girl. Girl. This is an American girl doll. They were originally released in the mid 1980s by the Pleasant Company. Remains popular well into the 21st century, appealing not only to the children, but also gaining a significant adult collector following. Why is it a scam? This is very expensive because sometimes they are over $1,150. American Girl dolls used to be known for their high quality, historical accuracy, and educational value. I had a twin Wait, American Girl doll when I was little. Very similar. Yeah, we kind of do. Kinda she has my eye color and everything. Is she a scam though? No. I think it's worth it because you can also get like historical ones with cool facts. You can get fun clothes. Yeah, because this doesn't match. And you can pass it down from generations. And you can pass it down to generations. Steven, Steven did you have one? Steven, get in here. I think Steven has. He has. <laughs> he has a few. It sounds like at least twenty-five. It's called being a collector. Mm. Okay. It's expensive. Wait, do you actually have these? No. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's worth it. I don't think I it have is. One. You have one? I've been saying that like fifteen times. Jeez, don't take it out on Tabitha. Scene, I said I had one when I was little. Okay. It was a what, twin. what happened yeah, to it? What suffer. happened to the other one? She's worth it. You're not. <laughs> Look at that little cheerleading pose. She's off to a great start. All right, Chase, you're looking cool. You're about to put on the Inventist Orbit Wheel skates. Okay. These strange skates cost $100 and give a fun alternative to rollerblading. As the description says, a set of Orbit Wheels is a cross between a skateboard and a pair of inline skates. When you're ready to ride, simply put your foot in the wheel and away you'll go. According to a large amount of negative reviews, Orbit Wheels aren't as simple as just like stepping on and taking off. Okay. Oh! <laughs> I'm gonna use Steven. Hey, you're off to a great start. I have wait, about 17 one-star reviews in front of me right wait, now. Wait, Bree, how do I move forward? It just goes side to you, side. You have to squiggle, like. <laughs> oh my foot! No, I'm sorry, Steven. <laughs> one star for do almost it, being it. impossible. One star, no way. One star, you get less tired running. One star, impossible. One star, would only purchase again if they came with a Tony Hawk instructor. I think it's safe to say it's worth it. It's I mean, not safe, but you're right about saying that. Was that was entertaining. Do you no, want to do the honor? Please. This is definitely a scam. Worth it. No. Oh, it's worth it? It's a scam. Oh, yeah. So get this, Chase. Drum roll. <laughs> there ended up being eight scams and 11 things that were worth it. So that means I don't think the internet is lying as much Let's as we go. thought. Let's go! Yay, internet! Whoa! That was not worth it. Oh. 